My client is a 40-year-old African-American male who is experiencing anxiety due to communication and relationship issues with other family members. My client's history includes growing up in a single mother household with three other siblings, two brothers and one sister. Due to growing up in a single mother household, the client had to become a guardian or a father role to the other siblings. At the age of 18, the client moved to Houston for about 10 years and was abusing drugs and alcohol and was in involved in homosexual activities. Since being back in 2005, the client was diagnosed with AIDS. When the client explained to his family that he was diagnosed with AIDS, they did not take it very well. So now they have accepted for who he is now. The client is ter currently taking medication uh, Chuamec, Fluoxazole, and do Dopazone for his AIDS. Client, the client used to take paroxetone and drisperum for his anxiety. The client has stated that he no longer takes that, medi that anxiety medication due to feeling drowsy and unable to get anything done throughout the day. Throughout my sessions and assessment with the client, I have diagnosed at this time unspecified anxiety disorder due to due to that the client is not showing enough criteria to be to be to have a specified anxiety disorder our initial goal was to have a better communication and a be better communication and a better relationship with other family members. But after a couple months, the client has realized that the goal is to be focused on himself more than the communication and relationship. The client has realized this at this time due to causing noticing that his he causes anxiety to other family members in the house and is more of a burden for for them too. The client has stated that he no longer wants to be that burden and wants to respect them for who they are. So our new goal is to have a more self-awareness and respect for others in the house, thus reducing his anxiety.